Yo, 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 what's good with my people? You already know who it is. It's Mr. Lewis. I'm eating right now. But I have some things on my mind, so y'all might have to deal with me eating and having this conversation with y'all. So, um, it's about that time that I, you know, spoke my mind a little bit on some things that's been going on. And again, it's just my perspective, my way of seeing things and, you know, how I was raised. But uh, yeah, I was just thinking about all the stuff that's going on right now around us. You know, oh, yeah, I'm feeling this. There's, there's just a lot of stuff going on. And more than ever right now, we need to be lifting ourselves up as much as possible, filling our environment up with just things that's going to lift us up and motivate us and uh, make us just more energized for what it is that we really want to do and what we, what we really should be doing. I know that's kind of like, right? Yeah. Because that's, that's just the attitude that, and the action that I see from a lot of people that, you know, I had these conversations with. Uh, it's like, yeah, I agree with you, but man, I just got this going on right now. You know, it's like we're all kind of stuck in that mode. But at the same time, there are priorities in our lives that it's like some things need to be dealt with uh, sooner than later. And, you know, there's a lot of things that we need to really start seeing. Okay, like this is important. I need to start figuring this stuff out. You can't just keep ignoring what's going on. And I need to start, you know, like handling this. Like whatever it is. And that's the thing, like we, we, we be ignoring the problem too much. Like it's like we know there's a problem there. And instead of coming at the head, you know, strong and, and accepting your part in the problem you have, <clears throat> we want to ignore it. But yeah, again, it's time that we accept our faults, deal with the problem, and get through the problem. I just deal with it like, man, I just got to just deal with this for the rest of my life. Like, nah, you can solve your problem. Spend your life solving your problem for the rest of your life. Uh, spend the rest of your life you know, working towards that, keeping that stuff on your mind. And really, like, I was talking to my brother, Jamar, today, and, you know, we were talking about rebuilding the culture, Charles the Castle, and, you know, Savvy House, what he got going on, and how it's all connected, and how in order for us to just be doing these things, we have to put dates on a calendar to rebuild the culture and to continue to do what we're doing. and. You know, just put things in action, really. But, you know, back to what I was saying, we have to stop ignoring the problem and face it and move on. Like, move on, move forward, move forward, keep moving forward. You know, don't let people just, you know, keep you down in a certain energy just because um, they want to and they still there. Because that's what people will do to you. And that's when you start evolving out of something and, and having a new way of thinking. And, you know, people who have not evolved yet will make it seem like what you're experiencing is not real. Um, and I'm not talking about like the whole spiritual stuff that, you know, we, we know oh, I experienced this. I'm talking about like physical changes that you feel. And, and are really going through like uh, not to say nothing I don't man I know sometimes y'all just be 
everywhere, you know, too deep, too deep for uh, things, and I don't be that deep sometimes, but anyway, the mistakes that I made in my life have got me to where I am today because I dealt with the problem at an early age. I said, man, I can't just be sitting around not doing nothing with my life. You know, I, I, I thought to myself, like, man, I can't keep, you know, partaking in these unhealthy habits that I have. You know, I can't keep messing with these women out here. Um, I, I decided to deal with those things, you know, before I even got out of high school. And, it, and again, it, it continued after that. You know, as I got older, I continued to keep these things on my mind and evolve my lifestyle, stay away from certain things. It took time, it took some years, but again, it was on my mind. I was talking about it, it was in my music. Um, you know, I already came from a religious background, already besides the religious background, you know, I already came from a, a spiritual background, you know, and heightened thinking, like, since I was young, I felt like I was going to do something special, like, I could be somebody special, too, you know, like, I see somebody doing something great, and I'm like, I could do that, too, like, I could be great, like, I could, I could, I could, I could do this, you know, I've been thinking like that for a long time. And I see how the world has rubbed off on me. I see how my environment and my, my upbringing has rubbed off on me. Uh, you know, my childhood, you know, my teenage years, I would say, the things that we used to just be involved with really shaped, you know, my adulthood. And those are the things that I started to fight with as, you know, I started evolving, like I'm saying, and thinking different and changing my, my habits and just, you know, just making a change for myself. So that's basically all I'm saying, y'all. Can't keep ignoring the problem, going through the same thing over and over and over and over. And we know what's going on. We know it. Like, we feel it. And, it's, and then we just go through it again and then we end up somewhere we don't want to be. You know, sometimes the mistakes that we make, you, you can't go back. There ain't no going back. Sometimes if we keep ignoring these things, they get too far away from us and it's, and it's, it's over. Like, because we make the wrong decision and we've been holding on to this for so long, you know. We, we, gotta, we gotta let it go. We have to know we're bigger than these problems. There's more that I want in my life that's more important than this. You know, so think about you first. Love yourself more. You know, continue to better yourself and, and, and move towards, you know, being more successful because you're already successful. We are already alive. Be more grateful for what you have and realize there's more people who have it worse than us, really worse than us. And I feel like it's coming. You know, there's a lot of stuff, like I said, there's a lot of stuff going on. I don't feel like it's coming. I feel like we healing, we doing this, it's, it's a lot going on, y'all. So prepare yourself, get mentally right, get mentally tougher. Stop just accepting this stuff. You know, you gotta kind of have a little heart to make it through the thoughts that are going to hold you back and you got to make it through the thoughts that you think other people are going to think about the changes that you got to make in your life like man you stop doing this you stop eating meat or you just stop hanging out with these people you just stop you know Whatever it is that you do, you know, we're always going to have those thoughts in our mind. Like, dang, what if these people, what if they just think this and, and, 
they gonna think I'm tripping or this and this and that. And it's like, you know, that, that's not that's not healing you. Yeah. They not gonna heal you. They not gonna be there for you. If they not if they haven't already been there for you. Uh, they're always switching up. They gonna continue to switch up on you. It's, it's simple math. And at the same time, it's it's chess because we have to be more ahead of the moves that we make it. But yeah, you know, I'm gonna continue to just uh, spread some motivation to y'all, some upliftment, you know, some positive vibrations, all that good stuff. I'm gonna continue to do that regardless of what people think and all the stuff they're gonna say and all the stuff they're gonna bring up. Like, I already know it's coming. I've been dealing with it, you know, nobody else deals with it but me, so if you're not finna deal with it, then if you're not finna help, you know, make these changes with me and for me, then what people think is just for their entertainment because they're bored or, you know, they don't have their own business to, to handle, you know, if they do what they do, so be mentally stronger, you know, said, um, keep rebuilding your culture, keep eating healthy, keep learning skills that's going to make you more self-sufficient, keep, keep it up, y'all, all right, I'm gone, peace.